Hey guys, welcome to the Alpha Point. I'm Vishal, and today I'm going to show Samsung Galaxy Note 2 running Android 4.4.2 KitKat version from the Omni team. This is the latest nightly build from the Omni team here. So let's see what are the features here, what are working, and what is not working. So first, see what is the version number here first. As you can see. Android version 4.4.2, Omni version 4.4.2, 2013, 12, 13. The nightly will be based on MG9 here. The kernel version, build number. So this is the latest build from Omni team here. See here. As we can see Android 4.4.2. Here the emojis of KitKat here. So this is the latest build from the Omni team here. The first best thing in Android KitKat is the addition of Google Now in the home screen. We just need to say OK Google and it will bring out the Google Now option. So let's, so let's test it here. OK Google, as you can see it has started and we just need to say anything and it will search it on the web here. So just close it. Now what we have is the start with the home screen here we have a new home screen and new background we have the default two home screen was added to add a new home screen we just need to press open the app drawer and drag it to create a new home screen here now there are four home screen here if you you can add unlimited number of home screen here just drag an application there or if you want to delete a home screen just delete this application and it will delete the home screen here now there is only just three home screen now we have the folder option in the in our home here to create a folder just drag an application to another you can rename it here just rename this here we have rename option here the sms has been created in hangouts here Open the Hangouts and the SMS has been in integrated into it. You just don't need to go to a message application and Hangouts twice. Like as you can see, there is no messaging app right here. No messaging app. H K M M message phone phone. No messaging app. Hangout messaging has been completely integrated in Hangout. We have all the Google apps here. So. Let's see the app drawer. These are the application has been added. Play newsstand, play store, play games, play movies. Quick Office has been integrated completely in the Android KitKat. The Chrome browser has improved here. So these are the application has been added in Android 4.4.2. Now see the lock screen here. The lock screen is we have a new unlock option here. Just a graphic new graphical interface here just drag it and it will unlock the device we have this white ring coming out of here if we drag if we just swipe from our left it will show the option to add widgets in the lock screen menu like the note 3 just add an application here or i just i didn't set up the my google account here so this is it is just saying to add an account here like the music player just swipe it and we can just switch back our main home screen just swipe from your right and it will bring out the camera application the camera application is working fine but i found out some problem in the videos here the video is not working video is working but it may some sometimes pro show problem and you need to close the camera application here now see what are the option here press this and it will show wallpapers you can see wallpaper widget settings here or to change those settings just keep holding it so this is it now see what are in settings option here in settings we have wi-fi bluetooth data uses mode in mode we have default application app since this is no messaging app it is just going to have the hangouts nfc nfc is working here tethering VPN, mobile network, mobile plan, cell broadcast. The only option that is not working in 
Android 4.4.2 .4 it's a tethering option it is not showing in others device the other device is not detecting this device as the tethering option has some bugs now we have interface we have bars see what we have bars it network count notification count it will bring out the notification count in your status bar if we have a notification network activity just indicate uplink and downlink or you can enable network speed indicator to indicate the speed in your status bar we have menus it will just show the screenshot option or screen record option screen record option we just you, you need to use by ADT in your PC we have notification drawer settings here it will just as you can see according to time it is showing an image here it will show different image in different timing here active display what active display is like if you receive an notification from anyone it will blank out your screen and it will show your notification here with messaging around and you can you can tweak this by selecting here notification text all notification low priority pocket mode sunlight mode excluded application and these are the settings that you can tweak with and in mode we have clear all option like we, you can tweak the clear all application here it is showing the memory here as you can see the total memory and the the used memory here in small option and in notification panel it will also show a bar like to clear all the recent application this has been added in android 4.4.2 now we have sound settings the default sound settings here then in display settings we have brightness wallpaper sleep daydream what daydream is like if your device is in dock or charging it will show time here like this or you can change tweak it to show different things here like if you want to change this you can show different kinds of things or you can go to market and download a better application than this this is default in android 4.4 and you can change the font size notification light battery light you can tweak the battery light here the way the way you, you want here cost camera screen of animation you can change those you can change the button settings like if you just hold your back button it will close the application as as i have said that long press and it will kill the application home press double tap it and it will switch between application like it's gonna switch between camera application and the settings as the last application used by me was cam now let's see what you can speak all the settings like menu key home button all those settings here we have storage option it will show just so the your storage options internal xd card your battery option you, you can tweak your battery there or show the percentage in apps we have the downloaded application running application all applications location settings security settings you if you want to add enable widgets in your lock screen you need to enable it from here power button instantly locks these are the application that you can change in security option here apps permission you can disable any app using from any services like if you want to disable location settings to not uh, your settings to not read your contacts you can disable it here or you can change anything that you want like camera application to disable recording audio so this is can be handy for you if you want to disable anything we have the language and inputs see what are the language available from africans to as you can see i'm swapping it slowly so that you can see all the language that are available android 4.4.2 there are many language that has been added in this version so 
so these are the languages that has been added in Android 4.4.2 most of them were present in the previous version we have backup and reset option you can add user in add account all your applications user like Google or IMAP corporate or other user options like your messaging app your email app you will be here your date and time settings accessibility you can print out your application right from you document right from here and information about your device here you can check your status legal information here you can read out those see the notification here these are option in the notification here immersive off as you can see it will just make your device full screen just swipe it and it will again back it you can disable the here uh, navigation bar if you have the nexus device in android 4.4.2 this has been immersive has been added in Android 4.4.2 here and Android 4.4.2 has added some security enhancements two security enhancements in messaging app and in startup as you can read those in change log so this is it from this video guys hope you liked it and future video will show how to install this too thank you for watching and don't forget to like and subscribe thank you